Today, the new Labrador Retriever is officially on all platforms in Call of the Wild. And in honor of that, we're going to be taking out Chase to try and get his first ever Jackrabbit out here on Lightning Lakes. Well, it's not exactly a Jackrabbit, but we do happen to have a really nice Drake Mallard Duck out there. He's close to dying potential. He's about 315 yards out there. And we should be able to have Chase go over there and fetch him up. I do believe at this point, since we have the... Ooh, I would like to get him too. I would definitely like to get him too. Now we have the caller. He's roughly 215 out there. So we could get a little bit closer. We'll set up the caller. And we'll see if we can't get this gobbler to come in. That'd be kind of cool if he did. All right, let's call. All right, we got the caller going. Now let's see if this gobbler is going to step out. We're going to be using the 22 rifle. Just because I don't really want to spook that duck. He's right out there, 280 yards. I don't think he would spook from one shot in a 22. And look at, there goes the whitetail. That is not the same herd of whitetail. That's actually a decent buck. Real decent buck. And they're crossing right out there. Wow, that's pretty cool. All right, so our gobbler should be coming out here any second now. There he is, right there, right there, right there. All right, he's about 115 yards out from us. Right there. Got him. Perfect. Okay, now we're gonna send Chase after him. All right, buddy, go get him. Go get him, buddy. And I don't believe our duck would have spooked from that. Nope, he didn't. He's right out there. It's gonna be a tough shot. I don't remember how to shoot 250 yards with this, but I'm pretty sure that first milladot down is about 250. Yep, that's exactly what that is. Wow. We just dusted that duck. Nothing even knew what happened. Look at that. But over here, you can see Chase is coming back with our nice gobbler. Look at that. Quite the sight to see, it really is. Yo, Lab, I don't know how the heck he's gonna get up here though, I just thought about that. Oh, he's gonna do it just like that. He's coming all the way around the backside and he's gonna bring it right to us. Atta boy, thank you so much, buddy. Thank you so much. Good job, good job. It's gonna be a 4.26 and we took a 99 yard shot on that gobbler there. Well, speaking of dogs, one just growled behind me there. All right, well, since we absolutely smoked that one duck, why not try and get another Drake out here? This one's about 250. He's in the water, so he actually might float even closer to us. We'll hold a little bit low. And smoked him. All right, that'll do, that will do. Um, I do believe he's only gonna go out to 200 yards maximum, and that's actually gonna sit right there. So, perfect. Let's get over there and go get him. Yeah, we do have the increased distance perk, and I'll show you that right now. As we're heading over here, going to hunting dog, traits, it is, well, there's two. One is right here, your dog will run further away and it search for something to retrieve. And the other one is over here where your dog retrieves at longer distances and is less burdened by carrying harvest. So we have level 15 locked in and level 30 locked in. And right now we're gonna kind of put it to the test to see how far he's gonna go to get our duck. Right there we're sitting at 160. Now before he wouldn't go to 100. 100 yards was maximum. So now we're at 160. Let's see if he goes to get our duck. There's two ducks. The one in the water is 160, and the one on shore is 180. But he's in the water, and he's headed that direction. There he goes. Atta boy, Chase. Atta boy. Look at that. He's going right to the ducks. The ducks don't even care. He's going straight for them. It's looking good. It's looking real good. How the heck do you not? Okay, he's got him. He's got him. He's got the duck and they're all taking off. They're all taking off. Look at that. That was so cool. So we kind of stopped for a second and I think maybe because he was distracted by those other ducks that were up on shore, then they all took off and he picked up the duck and now he's coming right towards us. 
with a big old Drake, Greenhead, Mallard, Duck. I do believe they're both gold potential. But this is going to be his first big Greenhead right here. His first gold potential Drake, Duck. He has gotten a few Drakes, but nothing this size. This is going to be his biggest one. 16.17 gold and a 270 yard headshot. Back of the headshot. What a beautiful duck as well. Look at that. Big old triple curly Drake Mallard duck. It's going to be really cool to watch him go all the way across this little lake here and then go onto the shore to find this duck. So I'm actually looking quite forward to this. He is right on top of that duck. I don't know if he's going to go any further. Nope. He went 165 yards and that is it. So we're going to have to help him out a little bit. We're actually going to go towards him and then we're going to have him fetch again. So he should essentially turn back around. Yep, just like that. And he should be able to find that duck. That a boy, that a boy, that a boy. Go for it, buddy. Go for it. You got this. You got this. Come on, buddy. You can find him. You can find him. What is in there? Oh, a moose. All right. So we couldn't quite find him just yet. But it's to be expected. Sometimes it's going to happen, you know? Even with the greatest dog in the world, sometimes they just don't know where the animal went because you know they're not like you they haven't seen the animal go down they just know it went over there somewhere and they try and use their senses to figure out where it's at just like that Atta boy, good dog he found him he found him right up in that tall thick grass good job chase wow and he's got a huge piebald greenhead mallard duck what do you got there buddy what do you got look at that wow what a good job. What a good job, buddy. Good job. All right. Well, let's pick him up. It's going to be a 17.56 gold. And we pulled off a 290 yard headshot. That's our biggest duck so far, though. And that is his biggest Drake, Mallard Duck, that he's ever retrieved. Right there. Atta boy. Good dog. You did an amazing job out there, buddy. Thanks so much for the help. Thank you so much. All right. We really got to find some of these jackrabbits. They're so difficult to find. We even have locations where they should be. And we're just not finding them. We got tracks. We got fleeing tracks. We got zones. But we can't find the jackrabbits. Well, again, we've yet to find a single jackrabbit, but we did get a call from another gobbler right down over this ridge here. So we set up the caller right behind us. This time we happen to have the 12 gauge shotgun with the red dot, only because when he comes up over this ridge, he's gonna be less than 50 yards out. And at that point, we might as well just use the 12 gauge. Oh, right there, right there, right there. Max White Gobbler, Max White Gobbler coming in. He's 80 yards out right there. Now we gotta remember there could be one coming in from over here too. Doesn't look like it though. All right, so let's get ready on this one. Should be stepping out here any minute now. And right there he is, 60 yards out. I forgot where my shotgun is, there it is. All right, he's like 40 right there. Rolled him right over. Perfect shot. I do believe that might be the only gobbler here, because otherwise we would have seen one take. Oh, right there, right there! Doubled up! Woo! We wait till he landed, stuck his head up, held for about 55, and smoked him. All right, Chase, go get him, buddy. Go get him. You got two gobblers to go get. Two gobblers, boy. What are you doing? What are you, are you sleeping over there? What the heck are you doing? <laughs> He's like just sitting there laying there completely calm after both those shots. You silly dog. Oh, you didn't like that one, huh? You wanna get this one instead? Okay, I don't blame you. Oh, so he decided to opt out of that first one and go back to the original one there. Good job, buddy. Go get the other one. All right. Go get the other one. All right. We're going to go over here. We'll grab this collar. And then... 
Chase brought our goblet over. Good job. Go get him. Go get the other one. Go get the other one. Okay, I know. You got him. Good job. Go get him, buddy. Go get him. Wow, well, would you look at that? He found him. All right. Out of boy. Finally. So, to be fair, he is pretty tired. He's been hunting all day with me. We've been getting a ton of geese. So, that's probably why he didn't want to get it just right away, but eventually he did get them and there's our shot 58 yard head neck shot that was our uh that's actually not even our max weight gobbler that was the second one that just landed there so incredible shot 58 yards and this one was the first one 39 yards 4.41 you're talking just absolutely drill that thing three in the neck one in the head two in the chest he was just smoked all right, I'd really, really like to find a couple of jackrabbits here. I mean, that was kind of the main focus of this hunt. But so far, it is not leaning that direction. Not even a little bit at all. I'm trying to figure out where to even go to find them. There used to be tons of them down here. So what I'm thinking is we're going to go over here, loop around, and kind of head this way. There should be some jackrabbits down here as well. I know there's tracks and there's zones, so it's not like they're not here. Just a matter of getting lucky enough to find them. Well, I can't believe we're going to say this, but we finally got a call from a jackrabbit. Right down over this ravine on the other side. We haven't spotted it yet, but at least we know there's one around here. Oh, I hear it taking off. Alright, we just jumped one up right here. He should be going out across this opening any second now. Chase is over there too. Oh, right there. We got one. Another one, another one. I can't see it. It stopped. Right there. Got him. Perfect shot. He's going down right there. And then we got something just crossed over here. I'm not sure what that was, but... Anyways, Chase, go get him, buddy. We got two jackrabbits down. Finally. All right, here we go. Chase is coming back with our first jackrabbit retrieval right there. Out of boy. Good job. Go get the other one now. Go get the other one. Okay, so he should go get it right now without us pressing anything. Yep. He's going for it. He's going for it. That was uh, like 120 yards out there, so he can definitely get it. Let's watch him. He's looking for it. He's looking for it. And he is locked on. He's got it. Now, that was actually quite interesting. He didn't really grab it right away. He just started sniffing around it. And then he picked it up. And now he's coming in. Yep, there we go. Jackrabbit number two. I do believe they're both females. Good job, buddy. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. 38 yard neck shot there. Got this one at 114 yards in the skull. Yep, and they're both female. Oh, right over there, right over there. You're telling me there's a jackrabbit in this grass? How are we gonna see him? Well, we should probably run over there and try and... Actually, no, I don't know if we should do that either. I feel like the best thing to do would be maybe... Oh, right there! I did not know he was going to be right there. That was not very smart. That was definitely not very smart. Wow. What the heck did we just do? As soon as I saw him, we were already taking the shot, so there's really nothing we can do to go back in time. And not take that shot, but, uh... Yeah, he was right there. Son of a... Well, I do think that they should still come out over here somewhere, right? Yep, right there. Right there, perfect. So, in a sense, it actually worked out pretty good. Because we got two of them out there. That one smoked. And that one, we should be able to get a shot off here in a second. 
stop behind that little brush patch there and now he's right right behind that tree go fetch him up buddy go get him in fact it should be laying right here i don't know why you can't find it you ran right past it like three times but you found it eventually so good job a boy there's nothing else we didn't get anything else i'm sorry we only got the one all right we'll give you a treat he's probably hungry i'll tell you what it would be a little bit more helpful if these dogs could actually help find some animals you know what i mean because in real life if you're hunting with the yellow lab yeah he's gonna fetch all your animals but he's also gonna help you flush them up too so if he could get out in front of us and then like maybe bark or something anytime he saw you know something take off then we would know at least there's something over there right there right there right there right there right there We got him! Where'd the other one go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Right there. I can't see, I can't see! Well, we got one. He's laying right there. We literally shot over the top of his head. He was so close. We should have zeroed for 50, but... We got him. He's big, too. He's a real nice one. And it's going to be a 5.4 gold. He is absolutely massive. Hit him. Well, we shot super high the first time. The second time we hit super low, but that did take him down. 37 yards, and that was an 11 pound, almost 12 pounder. Huge jackrabbit. Right there, right there. Got him. Perfect shot. He's down. Oh, another one. Another one. Nope. All right, buddy, go get him. Go get him, buddy. Another nice jackrabbit is down. And there we have it. 79 yard shot, 4.09. He wasn't very big. I knew he wasn't very big, but. Where are you at? Where are you at, buddy? Good boy. We'll give you a cookie. You did a really good job that time, actually. Out of boy. Out of boy. Okay, we got a female there. And I'm not sure where the male went, but there should be one. Oh, there's a male. Oh, look at all three of them. Well, we got one down. There we go. Another jackrabbit. That's going to be a female. I actually thought that we got a male before, but maybe not. Good job, buddy. Good job. All right. I want to try and find out one more thing, and that is how far is Chase willing to fetch a turkey? We got one out here at 200 yards. And we're gonna take a shot. Actually, he's like one seven. Eh, he's like two oh five right there. And that should take him down. No, don't fly this way. That kind of defeats the whole purpose of it. <laughs> I mean, it's still kind of cool. He'll be able to go there and get him, but instead of one sixty, now he is only one hundred and thirty yards. So, go get him, buddy. Either way, he should be able to fetch him. Fetch him up. Oh, he's going the wrong way. Wait. Oh, so he's going all the way down there. Holy, he's going way around. I don't know if he's going to be able to make it that far. So we see him right there. Oh, he's popping out. He's popping out. I lost sight of him right there. Not sure if he kept on going. I would imagine he probably did. 
He did. Oh my god, look at he's way the heck down there, you guys. He is way down there. And he's headed towards our gobbler. Which is right there. He's got him. No way. Dude, he just ran at least 300 yards all the way around this mountain. Came all the way down the side and grabbed our gobbler. That is exactly what this dog just did. Look at, there he goes, right there. Right there. Look at, oh, rabbits, rabbits. Good job, buddy, good job. So, I'm pretty sure he dropped him because he saw the rabbit. Oh, right there. All right, that's... Uh, quite a ways out there. Okay, we got him slow down. Got him! Woo! Perfect. Apparently there was a couple out there. Um, but... He should be able to fetch him up to us now. Go get him, buddy! Go get him! Well, would you look at this? Would you look at this? He's got our rabbit. He's got our rabbit right here. He brought it right to us. What a good boy. What a good boy. There he is, 3.27. And that was a 160 yard shot. Wow, these things look way cooler than the ones that we were hunting before. But, what'd you do with our gobbler, buddy? What'd you do with him? It's okay, go find him. Fetch him up. All right, so we decided to help him out a little bit and come this direction just so we can... No way, he's got him. Look at that. Oh my God, that's so freaking cool. Look at that. Out a boy, Chase. Good job, buddy. Good job. Wow, good job. Good boy. Thank you so much for the help. Well, here he is. That was a 185 yard shot. And he went all the way down there and got him. Very nice Maxway Gobbler. But that is going to be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And let me know how you guys are enjoying the new Labrador Retrievers in Call of the Wild. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time. Wow. These dogs really do change the game. They really do. Atta boy. Thank you so much, buddy. Thank you so much. And we'll give you a treat.